Well, leave it to football to be the thing that brings people together in D.C. as the Houston Roughnecks visit the D.C. Defenders in week two of the UFL on Fox. Limited opportunities. On first down, first play from scrimmage. Ratliff Williams one hands it and he's brought down right away. And the handoff taken by T.J. Pledger. Has time going deep down the sideline and just overthrew Ratliff Williams. And so it will be three and out for the Roughnecks. Blocked. Momo Sinogo with the block for the defenders. And they're going to get it with great field position just beyond the 10 yard line. This is the way this defender team wanted to start. Special players. Here comes the route. The rush from the defense is left, and they get there. Beautiful job. Getting that block, one-handed, and then the recovery, and it felt like that one was even fumbled. I don't know why Houston didn't just jump on that ball, but they just kind of kick it out of bounds. At the 11-yard line. Cameron Harris. One. Here's Tama to the air. With time, overthrows, and it's picked off. Overthrew a wide open receiver and Cornelder taking it back the other way for Houston. He's going all the way. No one's going to catch him. Touchdown, Roughnecks. To get their hands on the football right here. Bam, a little tip. And there's Cornelder in perfect position to get that tip. And then it's all about the return. Beautiful job by his teammates getting some blocks out in the front. Don't know what that offensive lineman was doing. He didn't even try for the tackle. And Elder goes the distance. We got a pick six. Some fireworks here early. Garantano lost that one up. From the 37. And the handoff taken by Cam Harris. The thing about this league, Kurt, it's that these games are going to be close one possession games late. They have been all weekend long as Cam Harris gets out across the 45-yard line. On third and one, Harris caught the backfield. Hey, Houston will be off the field this time. Reuben Foster along with Chris Odom. Third game, play clock winding down. And pleasure again, finding way out to the 36-yard line. And here comes the pressure. Garantano. And he just throws that away wisely. Needing 13, knocked down at the line of scrimmage. It will be incomplete. And when you talk to Curtis Johnson, the head coach, he says he's even more focused this year, but there's a wide open receiver for the defender is down here Ruben F Foster is a violent human he could have batted that ball down but he waited to hit that guy in the back well, that's Cam Harris out of the backfield exactly what Jordan said he wanted to do use that aggressiveness and use it against them and now they're finding their rhythm and another quick pass this one made by Kelvin Harmon the reception Toby Johnson Kurt right in the middle big old 300 pounder easy to see he won't stop Harris here Cam Harris picks up the first down for D.C. The keeper, Tamu, gets the first and more down. From the four, the handoff, and Hagen stopped right at the line of scrimmage. No gain. Play number 11 on the drive. Handoff, fighting, touchdown, Darius Hagen and the defenders. Tamu into the shadows and it falls incomplete. Handing it off to Pledger again. TJ Pledger going to fight his way forward. All right, here's Reed set at first pass attempt on third down. Gets it off, finds a man open, and it's good enough for plenty to us this week. He thinks he's the best player with the ball in his hand on the team. And a little dump pass to Pledger, not fooling the defenders at all. Joe Wallace can do a little bit of everything. Trying to convert to running back. And they go in that direction, but it's not even close. Sit down, it yeah. gets worse and worse and worse. Yeah, just tighter and tighter and tighter. Third and four. 
overthrows his man in the middle of the field. Incomplete intended for Kelvin Harmon. And, and now he'll get to dial it up against the backup quarterback. Reed Sennett still in there. Justin Hall with the reception. Ah! Add one backer in a blitz. They come out of the backfield. Senate quick pass, Hall. Kirk Merritt looking for room, gets it outside, and spins his way for a pickup for Deontay Anderson. So they can feel good about this drive, getting points. 51-yard attempt, it is down, up, and through. It's Colston on the outside, and what a, what a steal they got late in the draft with him as a wide receiver. Hey, you served your purpose. There's a big pass to Amu. Over the middle of the field is Chris Rowland. Minute and a half, and they're trying to get the lead. Yeah, and the middle of the field just opened wide open, and Rowland was perfect. Tamu up top. One-handed. It's caught. Was he inbounds? Yes. Of a catch as you will ever see. Let's see if he gets possession and gets these two feet down. A body part, perhaps. Left hand goes up. Beautiful job. Kind of tips it back to himself. Here is it going to go, and he's tipping it back to himself. And now is he going to control with that knee down? It does look like that left knee is down. So if he does establish control of that football, we'll have a knee down, and that would be a touchdown for the defenders. That is something special right there. Because they didn't use it. Going for two. Tamu won't get it. Pressure coming. Senate gets it out to Merritt. Slips a tackle, but couldn't stay on his feet. It's going to be there. Looks left and throws too high. Incomplete intended for Manuel Butler, and there's a late flag coming out. Pass interference. Defense number 20. 15 yard penalty from the previous spot. Includes an automatic first down. That you cannot take a sack. Quick pass over the middle of the field. Hall makes a move, slipping tackle. Get down. Now it's him versus the clock. He gets down, and they get the timeout. To tie it. And he does. And it has allowed them to really be successful offensively. Here's Pledger again. An opening and a stiff arm, and T.J. Pledger at foot eight. There's Merritt going in motion out of the backfield. Instead, it's a quick pass, and it's caught by Kiki Chisholm. Four. Senate throwing on the run. Got a man wide open. Once again, Chisholm. Touchdown, Houston. Well, this is going to pop wide open here on the right side. Why does it do that? Well, Sinnott wants to run, and then right there, as he becomes a runner, you got both defenders right here on the outside for D.C. Bite, and they stop, and Chisholm just walks behind him. He's wide open. The safety is late in his role, yeah. and it's an easy touchdown for Houston. I got to tell you, this has been a clinic from Reed Sinnott. Devin mentioned it earlier, being ready to go when your number is called, and he has come out in this ball game, and he has been ready mentally with protections getting them into the right play and he has also performed beautifully under pressure in duress in the pocket and putting points up his last two possessions a field goal a touchdown and now they'll go for two sidearm Merritt wrapped up right away out of those option style plays for Jordan Tomlin here's Darius Higgins on first down Big run will move the chains. You understood why you save things and give your bad plays on first down because now you're not off, you're on, you're not on schedule any longer, right? You're behind the chains and you just don't want to play from that vantage point. Tamu through the hands, incomplete of Kiki Cootie. He just got it off in time. Over the middle, he's got a man. That's the running back Merritt. And Kirk Merritt, the former wide receiver, takes it. He's tackled, and the ball comes out. D.C. recovers for Rod Gardner going back the other way now. What a quick turn of events. DeAndre Baker, the former first-round pick of the New York Giants, knocked that out and prevented what looked for a moment like a sure touchdown by Houston. Is fantastic this is a tight window throw he splits the defenders and Merritt 
Great cut, and now he is headed down the field, and Gardner is going to be right place, right time. Tamu throws, falling forward in Kevin Harmon. Makes the catch. Yeah, looks like Just he... about a yard shot of the marker. On first down, Hagens gets the blocks, gets the yardage. A handoff taken by Cameron Harris. Safety look, you're in trouble. Here's Tiago keeping it. He gets wrestled down to the ground late. Front one way and the quarterback goes the other. Here's third and one, Darius Hagens through a hole, gets just enough. His way back in. Tamu, Hagens out of the backfield. And slips forward. Seco. Needing the 21. Tamu, not gonna get there. He's brought down well short of the first down. 43 yards away on his first attempt today. And that one is true. Makes it a three-point contest. By three, just under 13 minutes left. Here's Senate batted backwards and it falls incomplete. Here they come. Good protection, Senate hits Ratliff Williams who can't fight through the tackle made by Michael Joseph. Okay. Here they go. Good play fake. Tamu makes the completion. Catching it is Kelvin Harmon. Cutting back is Harris. He's got running room. Gets it outside. Cameron Harris. And you and Kurt just talked about how big of a third down it was. And they don't convert it. Cutting back. Ellis. Got it and more. First down defenders. They did just convert. Fourth and long. Up top. Touchdown defenders. And Tamu just rolls to his right, and he sets up calmly, and this is beautiful. Look at the leverage right out over the top, right in front of his wide receiver and in front of the sharply dressed Devin Gardner. Devin, that was a beautiful throw. Take out. They go for two. They get it. Set themselves up for success. Quick pass by Senate out to Hall. Justin Hall fighting. It's going to be stopped. Looks like just shy of the first down. Santos Ramirez fighting back. Pledger oh, hitting the backfield, kept on going, and got the first. And this time they blow the whistle. It's going to be a delay of game. Delay of game. Offense. Five yard penalty. Remains third down. Oh. Come on, come on. Looks like the left side. Yep. Ball start. Offense number 74. Five yard penalty. Remains third down. Stop DC. Set it underneath. And that pass is caught. Emmanuel Butler. Come on. Let's go. On the run. They do get the stop right at the one yard line. So they will get the ball back. Clean snap. And he gets it off. Justin Hall from the 48. Already in D.C. territory with a move. Hall down the sideline. Quick pass. Chisholm. Oh, my goodness. right tackle moved. Ball start. Offense number 51. Five-yard penalty. Second down. Got to get it off before the play clock ends. They do. Pressure underneath bubbled. Pledger. He did make the grab. Now the clock continues because they didn't get a first down. Houston is a hurry up. Now they got it. They've got to know it's fourth down. Have to get the chains. Got to get it. Uh, looks like the right side of the line moved again. Ball start. Offense number 51. Five-yard penalty remains fourth down. Play the game. Here we go. Over the middle. He's got a man, and he missed him. 
They're asking for a flag, and there's one second left. Braden Bowman, the tight end, was the intended receiver this close. I mean, he, he has them right here. I cannot believe they played man coverage with nobody in the end zone when all they had to do was prevent a touchdown. I mean, D.C. gets away with it right there. There was no reason to blitz. There's no reason to play man because they have a shot, and Bowman just didn't locate the ball.